In 2007, Ohio University football on this field went paw to boot with the Wyoming Cowboys. In the end, they let one slip away. Get a shotgun this time on fourth and four, looking to spread the field as Carson Sweeney and pokes off it. We got Hall outside in the slot against Marsh. Sweeney's looking the other way, throws inside, and he'll finally end zone. Now to cash in on some payback in the opener of the 2008 season, the Bobcats will climb 7,200 feet to the highest field in the country, War Memorial Stadium in Jonah Field on the campus of the University of Wyoming for the opener of the 2008 season. It's the Bobcats and the Cowboys, and this is the scouting report on the opener. Joe Glenn enters his sixth year as a head coach on the High Plains. He took the Pokes to a 5-7 and seven season last year. Wyo's strengths, a defensive line that returns intact. They were sophomores last year. Their juniors this season, John Fletcher, Fred Givens, and Mitch Ryan are all set to go. The offensive line returns intact. Tim Bond is one of the best centers in the country. And in the backfield, Devin Moore is an Indianapolis native. He's a senior, and he's an all-Mountain West Conference performer. Questions? In the secondary, Ohio's deep receiving core could take advantage there. And it's a matchup of two first-year quarterbacks. Dax Crum is a junior college transfer, and Theo Scott will get the start for Ohio. Wyo's picked fifth in the Mountain West Conference. Ohio picked sixth in the MAC East. He's at the 20, the 10, and he's in. Touchdown, Bobcats. This is the second all-time meeting between Wyo and Ohio. And it's the fourth game between the Bobcats and a school from the Mountain West Conference. Our game day coverage begins at 1 o'clock with a one-hour pregame show on the Citizens Bank Ohio ISP Sports Network. And we'll stream our broadcast live for free on OhioBobcats.com. Tune back in here next week for highlights and a recap of the opener of the 2008 season, Ohio and Wyoming. I'm Russ Eisenstein. That's the Scouting Report, and this is Bobcat TV.